So I'm gonna jump into a recipe here. So we've got enough time for a few questions, tell you a little bit more about what I'm doing in sustainable new food media and how we can get the message out about this food to educate, entertain, and empower the three E's, educate, entertain, and empower people to make this food at home. Because that's really what it's all about. There's amazing restaurants around in LA. Like we're spoiled as vegans. Seriously, we are, we're spoiled. We have the best restaurants on earth other than New York here in LA, but the key is starting to put the love and the intention into this food by making it at home. So, with any further ado, I'm gonna do a beet pomegranate cacao superfood salad for you guys. You ready? You ready for some nom noms? Wow, all those people. I actually wanna take this mirror home later and uh, use it for things maybe other than food. But we're gonna start with We've got four large beets here. Now, in this case, I did steam these beets. I cooked these for about 30 minutes. You could do shredded raw beets if you want. That tastes as equally amazing in the salad. But in this case, I have four cooked diced medium beets. And you wanna go ahead and add that to your mixing bowl. Now, I'll admit something. I'm sometimes a lazy chef. To get this many seeds, you have to crack a lot of pomegranates. And I didn't have the patience this morning to crack that many pomegranates. It's an admission of guilt, I know. I'm a little bit on the lazy side. So, if you want to do this, you could probably use about three large pomegranates to equal a cup to a cup and a half of seeds. And add that to your mixing bowl. Do we have any cilantro fans in the house? Any cilantro haters? Whoa, there's always one. How many of you guys have done a proper cleanse, a proper detox? Who's on the detox tip? Got a lot, okay. Cilantro, particularly for heavy metals like mercury, lead, and metals like that, is a great chelator. A chelator is an ingredient that pulls the heavy metals from your tissues in your bloodstream so that you can effectively detoxify them. It does not do the detoxing, it chelates by pulling the metals out. It's up to you to flush out the heavy metals. That's a very important distinction. Cilantro doesn't flush, it pulls. So cilantro, things like chlorophyll, chlorella, awesome chelators to help get those heavy metals out of your system. Heavy metal! Yeah! We're starting life metal, you know what I mean? So instead of like the dragons in the dungeons and like chopping people's heads off, it's gonna be like empowering heavy metal. You know, like, it's time to detox your body so you can slay the dragons! You want about, um, you want about a half to three quarter cup of fresh cilantro here. And uh, we're just gonna do a rough chop here on the cilantro. And we're just gonna do again, a nice choppy chop of the herbs here. Suddenly I'm British. You'll find that I have about 30 characters in my head. I just go into them at any given moment. Now here's an interesting thing. The world record holder for the longest living woman, she was 123 years old. She was a French woman who ate two things every day of her life, olive oil and dark chocolate. She lived to 123. Saying something, you know what I mean? She rode her bike every day too. That's another thing, you gotta move the body. But olive oil and cacao, why? Why, does anybody know why? Give me a guess. Antioxidants, thank you sir. Eating such clean, good food, like olive oil and cacao, that her body was always scavenging the free radicals, right? So that's an important thing. And things like beets, pomegranates, blueberries, darkly pigmented foods have high levels of antioxidants and a thing called phycocyanins. That's what gives it the dark pigment. That's gonna help keep your body healthy. Can I say fight the C word or am I not allowed to say fight the C word? I'll say it! It helps to fight cancer! Any FDA representatives in the house? <laughs> the long pour, I ain't afraid, I ain't afraid. Yeah. Quarter cup of olive oil. I'm Puerto Rican so I kind of like it a little bit hot in here. So what I'm going to do is add a couple pinches of like hot pepper flakes. You want it? Come on, Blondie, you want it. I know, it's gonna make your hair straight, it's so hot. Add a couple of pieces here, hot pepper flakes, maybe one, two. That's all you need. Any more hot, you can't handle this. You guys in the hemp? Hemp! Whenever I hear hemp, I suddenly turn it James Brown. You got to get down with the hemp, girl. Ah, hemp is awesome because it's full of gamma linoleic acids, which are very heart healthy and for anybody ever asking the vegans the protein question for the 90 millionth time, we get enough protein, okay? Look at this. Yeah, we get enough protein, come on. But if you want a little extra protein in your diet, hemp seeds are up to 33% protein by weight. 
So go ahead and add about a quarter cup of hemp seeds to your mixing bowl. Cocoa! You guys ever had raw chocolate? Who's had raw chocolate? Hemp seeds, cacao, and goji berries are gonna be the first three superfoods to really bust through to the mainstream. Why? Because there's no prep involved. You rip them out of the bag and you eat them like this. Mm. 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 Oh yeah. Mmm. Chuck a con, chuck a con, right? You feel it. Makes you wanna dance. So in this case, we're gonna add a couple handfuls of cacao nibs. The purpose of salt is to bring out and meld all of the flavors together. I even add a pinch of salt to my smoothies sometimes because it just helps to round out the flavors and highlight the subtle flavors in your food. So just a pinch of salt is fine. One little pinch. Magnesium and zinc, the importance of these two minerals. Magnesium serves two great purposes. One, it calms your nerves so you can sleep better at night. Number two, it is the most heart healthy nutrient. Magnesium is so important to keep your arteries open, your blood pumping strong to all the places you need it most. And zinc. Zinc is so good for immune boosting and especially for men, for prostate health. Pumpkin seeds, awesome food for men. Keeping that zinc level up, keeping your prostate healthy. And you know what, it tastes awesome in this recipe. So we're gonna do about a quarter cup of pumpkin seeds as well. Who knows about Kamu Kamu? Okay, good. Kamu Kamu is the second highest source of vitamin C known to man. There's only one higher, does anyone know? It's the cockadoo plum. Yeah, I know, right, cockadoo. The cockadoo plum is native to Australia and New Zealand. It is gonna be the next big thing in superfoods when it comes out. It's the only known source higher than Kamu Kamu and vitamin C. That's gonna be huge, you guys. But until then, we got some Kamu. A quarter teaspoon of Kamu Kamu. Now, how I like to use Kamu, if I'm making like an orange Julius, or I've got orange juice or some kind of citrus shake, even like pies, Kamu is a great addition, but it's super tangy. So to this huge bowl, I'm only adding a quarter teaspoon. This is whole ground vanilla bean from Tahiti. It is so amazing. We're gonna add a quarter teaspoon to the bowl. Woo! For a pinch of sweetness, we have ground stevia powder. Now, stevia is awesome for three reasons. One, it's zero calorie. Two, it's zero glycemic. Three, it's a really easy way to boost up the sweetness level in any of your recipes. So, it's super potent, you guys. It's 30 times sweeter than table sugar, 30 times. So you never want to use stevia as a one-to-one -one substitute. You just want to use it as a supplemental sweetener to bring up the sweetness level. So again, a couple pinches will do of our whole ground stevia powder. And I love this brand. This is Ogeo. You guys may have noticed I'm using this amazing brand. They have this brand new whole ground stevia leaf. It just is my favorite sweetener right now because it gives you that little extra zing. Lemon! It matches your shirt, Eamon, and the lady behind you. Did you guys plan that? Did you guys send a text like, hey, if you wear yellow, I'm gonna wear yellow, but I'm gonna have like a cool monkey with sunglasses on my shirt, so don't wear your monkey shirt, because that would be weird. And we don't want to think people are like dating. If we're dating, that would be weird, because you're a lot older than me, I'm a lot. Fresh lemon juice, go ahead and just squeeze it over the bowl. Woo! You want about three tablespoons to this recipe? Oh yeah. Like, look at those colors. Do you guys see that? That's a pretty salad, right? That's like, that's like an 80s, metal ballad. That's like a foreigner song that you hear on a Sunday morning, you can't get it out of your head like, I wanna know what love is. He comes the hot step, but I'm the lyrical gangster. Alfonso, you're the man. Thank you for showing up. I love you. I would have your children if I could, but I can't. Um, how much time do I have, Ken Spector? 10? Okay, so here's an important thing. Taste your recipes before you serve them to people. Okay? Even if you're all cocky, like, oh yeah, that's done. I got that. No, 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 no. Taste. Taste the rainbow. A little bit more cacao, never hurt anybody. Yeah. We're gonna serve this up, and we're gonna get uh, samples here. So we're giving away samples of OGO Sport hemp and rice protein powder and I've got this amazing heirloom organic pasta I'm gonna be giving away. And after my lecture, I'm gonna be over at the bookstore near the main stage signing DVDs. So if you guys wanna ask some questions, uh, ask me about my tattoos, um, prison stories, um, that would be great. Just go over to the bookstore after I'm done, get a DVD, I'll sign it, I'll kiss it for you, kiss your babies, 
Um, let's give out some pasta and some uh, OGO sports samples, shall we? What up, Open Mike? How are you? You know, the best thing is to you guys, you are not alone in this. When you make one step toward eating healthier, one step to living a more conscious lifestyle, you'll find there's a whole community waiting to support you, no matter where you are in this world. So make that step, make that change. Live and honor yourself and give yourself the love you deserve, because that's what it's all about. It's all about self-love, because the more you love yourself, the more you give to yourself, the more you can tread lightly on this planet, the more you can give to others. And eating food that sustains you, that nourishes you, is an awesome way to do it. Okay guys, so this, what I'm handing out is OGO Sport. This is the best superfood company in the world. This is their sprouted brown rice and their organic hemp protein. Let's give it up for Jason Robles. Robles. Host of the upcoming cooking show channel. Cooking channel. Thank you guys so much. How to live to be one hundred. Jason W R O B as in baby. E L dot com. Check it out.